morning guys welcome to today girls are already down at the barn doing chores I have been up at the house finishing up a few business things that I had to do but today we are headed back to the barn, the barn. why are we going to the barn because Chino lost his shoe because Chino lost his shoe you guys remember it is show season and we need it back on so we're headed there as soon as we're done chores and we'll catch up with you guys there if you guys ever experienced when you get like a Charlie, have you guys ever had like a Charlie horse What's that it? it's like a muscle spasm and it hurts and then oh yeah my foot my um my foot got a cramp yesterday and um yeah what's that my purse so then you get the muscle spasm and then it goes away but then you have like a ache in your leg for a long time after oh no I have that okay he's the, well I'm like crippled. All right, so uh, yeah, he might not come, but he normally does. He normally comes right to Sophie when she goes to get him out of the field. And Gabby, Gabby, Gabby went to the bathroom. Oh, Gabby went to the bathroom. <laughs> I was wondering why it was suddenly so quiet. Actually, Gabby is pretty quiet. She's like her dad. Um, Gabby's gonna get Chino Bambino. Chance. I need to get grain and bring it. Chance. Hey, handsome. He's so Chance. Chance is in the field in our old, in our for, horse's old field with one other horse. There's two chestnuts in there. He's not even paying attention today. His head's buried in that round bale so far. Do you miss me at all? Do you think about the I love those ears. You've got the most forward, friendly, fun ears. No, you couldn't stand tall. So why one more bite, you, she said. Take one more bite. Call. He's like, I'm so stuffed. <laughs> so many years has gone by. But I think about you, about you all the time. Looks like you're changing <gasps> That is all. so funny. That is like Storm. So that's part of him that's like Storm. Something in the One of my friends is like, there's no way he's that big. When Sophie stands next to him, he just looks like the same size as Chino, which he's only actually like two inches taller than Chino, so that doesn't surprise me. But he is actually really, really tall. He's definitely taller than Chino. Definitely 17 one. So I'm gonna try and measure him today and show you guys. You guys remember when Gabby was 11 and we tried this horse and his name was Tommy. I think his name was Tommy and he was 17 one and he was a thoroughbred, ex-thoroughbred. And he was such a nice horse. I always like consider him one of the horses that got away. And we went and tried him and he was amazing. And Fiona said, no, like no way he's too tall. And I, and definitely he was so t too tall for her at that stage. And like the only reason that, another reason why we considered this guy, even though he's really tall is that Sophie, knock on wood, has gotten to the stage where she falls off less. Like even a year ago, definitely would not have considered a horse of that size because she was still, you know, not, she was still falling a lot. She doesn't fall anymore, not as often, hardly ever actually. I love this rooster, I love roosters. Chino's actually in the shelter, which is very bizarre. Never found him in the shelter ever. Actually once, I think. Well, hello. How are you? Why are you in there? Hey, you all fancy now? What's wrong? I know, are you missing your shoe? Yeah? You want Gabby? So I started hearing things, so I put music on, and I think he likes music. He likes music? Oh, he's totally meant for us. All right, there we go, we got it. Gabby will do it, because she knows how. But look at all Brandon's tails. Aren't they gorgeous? Like, yeah, this is Finn's tail. It's gonna be so cute. And then we even have a uh, Chance tail. Guess, which one's Finn's? This? Yes. <laughs> You're a genius, Sophie. <laughs> and this would be Chance. Yeah. Chance doesn't need a fake tail though. I like this cat. You guys know how I believe like in signs. When we first saw Chance, I didn't even notice the heart on his forehead. Like it took me about two hours to figure out that that was actually a heart on his forehead. And then I was shocked and now I can't unsee it. But another thing that seems so crazy to me. Remember when we had 
Storm and Stella. We had Storm and Stella and it was like such a, like they just went together. Storm and Stella, Stella and Storm. They just were a team. Like you could tell they went together. And now we have Chance and Chino. Chance and Chino, like we didn't even plan that. We did not even plan that. We're gonna measure him. Because one of my friends is like, there's no way he's that tall. He's probably tall. All right, well, we gotta square them up. Where do we measure, right here? All I right. I did it on the shoulders. Sixteen-three, I think that is. Oh, no, 17. No, I All don't right, know. let's do it again. <laughs> All right, we, we are, need Brandon. We need Brandon. <laughs> She almost whacked herself in the head with it. All right, measure Sorry, Chino. Just... Chino with the one shoe missing. <laughs> Bless you. I'd run a thousand miles if I could run with you. And from what I have heard, you do the same thing. We don't know where to do it. Yeah, no, we don't. I know we measure the width. This is why we let Brandon do it. Now that's even. There Six, or there? Is it? Underneath, 16.3. I need more of this. Imagine you tried to jump out. I definitely don't think he would try and jump out, though. Say it forever. We could be good together. Guess misery loves company. Better to late than never. You know we could do better. Oh, you lazy boy, she's... our vet on how to bring his weight up and keep him from getting hot because he is young and he is a thoroughbred and so we're working on that Just say the word. Oh, oh. whatever we would do we do it just for fun you only get so many trips around Sophie's over there playing uh, horse sounds, and this guy doesn't care, but Chino's out there neighing like crazy. See how he just moves his head? He's just slow. That's the part of him that's like Storm. Storm moves the same. This is a chance that Sophie loves. And like, it's funny cause he's just so slow, but he can get the striding and he will move out and move forward. We call him Chancy Pansy now. I got it for me. No, I say I need Brandon to measure him now. So the ad said 171. I'd run a thousand miles if I could run with you. And from what I have heard, you do the same thing. I know 
Sophie's young and inexperienced, but this is how Gabby learned, you guys. She learned by lunging Stella and lunging Storm and and <coughs> and practice. And that's what Sophie's gonna do too. And Gabby was 11, and Sophie's 12. And everybody starts this stuff at their own process. I know some kids at 12 are expert riders. And it looks so good now. Door! I'm coming in again. It looks good. Every time I come, he like slows down. Don't forget to do the other side. Good boy. Whoa, he knows that good. Good boy. Look at him, he's licking and chewing. That's one of my favorite things. Storm does that so good. I know. So this is, yeah, get Sophie Storm. Faster, uh, bigger stride, and taller, that's all. And thinner, like I always get paranoid when our horse is like not a bit chubby. I always worry about it, I stress about it, I don't sleep when they're not, when they're not a good weight. Anyway, we have a plan. We talked to the vet about his weight and we're gonna bring him up. And he was a thoroughbred and you guys know sometimes they're hard keepers. I don't think he's gonna be a super hard keeper because he loves his food and he eats. I think it's just getting him on the right food and the right amount of food and we have a plan for that. So, Are you guys shocked at the level of like happy Sophie is? Like at the level of confidence she is? Like she's out there lunging her horse and she does this on a regular basis with him. Not that he needs lunging. He doesn't need lunging like to get rid of the excess energy or anything, but she's using it for like groundwork and for um, building a bond and stuff. Sophie is gonna continue to ride Denver. So one of the reasons that she's um, gonna continue her lessons on Denver is because she's doing really well on him and she is learning a lot on him and he is a seasoned, experienced boy who has so much to teach her and we don't wanna stop that. Like we don't wanna stop her growth and her learning while she gets used to a new horse and while they get you know, used to each other. So in light of that, she's gonna still ride Denver. So I feel like we're covering all of our bases. You loved it? Did you make him canter? No. Yeah. You said just walk trot. Yeah, just walk trot. <laughs> so we can't even reach him. Well, my horse is tall and I'm short. Okay. Yeah. There we go. What do you think about that? You want to be a reindeer? Don't you know that you're beautiful?